Welcome back to All About the Smokies. We're here at the Clarion Inn in Pigeon Forge. We have made it to one of the probably best hotels I've been in. This is like our motel. <laughs> Let's take a look around this hotel. First room we're going to look at here is the bathroom. What do we think? I think it's it's a pretty nice shower from what I'm looking at. It's I don't know how recent it's been updated, but it looks really good. Um, one per, one sink, one faucet, and looks like they have the toilet in its own little room. Hmm. Little closet or armoire, whatever you want to call that. Here, plenty of space for your clothes to make sure they don't get wrinkled. Um, they got a little part of our stuff. We got a little K-cup machines and K-cups over here. So we can have our own coffee. <laughs> oh, yeah. And this is the main area. So you see uh like couch. Can, yeah. And a little table. There's a uh, bed lamp. There's the one king size bed, I guess, right? It's king in this room. They come in uh, two queens as well, I believe. Yeah. Uh then there's this table right here. The TV. The fancy TV. <laughs> A mirror and um, weird. Do you sit here and look at yourself in the mirror? <laughs> you sit, tell it like a table. <laughs> okay. All right, let's take a look at the, the best part. All right, so all the rooms come with balconies. There's two different views. This room, these balconies have a mountain view. I think the ones on the other side just view the parking lot from what I can tell. But we are on the sixth floor. It is a I, long way down. See, long way down. Oh my God, you can see a lot from here. Shh. You don't want to wake Alex up. He's obviously sleeping. He's not faking at all. <laughs> he always makes his weird squealing squeak noises when he sleeps. All right. Let's talk about the bed comfort, Alex. Okay. What do you think? By the way, I'm sleep talking. Uh, it's really comfy. I can eat a fixed bed while sleep comforting it. <laughs> yeah. It's um, actually comfy. Very similar to when I stayed in the con country inn. But this is the comfiest bed I've been in a hotel on. Yeah. So, bed comfort. We'll, we'll see how it is tonight when we actually sleep in it. But so far, it's so, good. So far, it's comfortable. All right, we've tested the bed comfort. Bed was obviously pretty comfortable. One, a couple of things that I want to point out. Um, it is a very nice room. Alex said it's one of the nicest he's stayed in. But I will say about the air conditioning. Now, I've said in previous videos, it's important to me that the air either runs constantly and makes a nice white noise, or that it's quiet enough that it's not going to disturb me while I'm sleeping. So, you can't even hear the air in here, but it's a nice temperature. Also, I want to point out, ceiling fan. That's not something that you typically get in a hotel. All right, one thing I noticed that I don't particularly love is that this stand, on well, one side of the bed, has no outlets. There's no plug-ins on the lamp. There's no places for your phone. If you want to use an outlet, you're having to reach back there and plug it in. I don't love that. So if you go to this other side, at least they have this thing. I've been seeing these pop up in various hotels. It does have two USB chargers and two actual plugs. It would be nice if they had something like that on each side, but at least they have or it on this had, side. Or if they had this over here. <laughs> yeah. What's nice too is uh, if you're working at this table, they do have two outlets here and an Ethernet cable that you can plug directly in. All right, this is Alex enjoying the lazy river. So I don't know if the lazy river is broken right now. It's been very nice and very warm. And we've enjoyed kind of chilling in it, but it's turned into just kind of a hangout zone for people. Am I looking at the camera? Yeah. Like 
the, been a hangout zone for people, but there is no current whatsoever. So what's our final take on the Clarion Inn here in Pigeon Forge? Alex, what's your thoughts? I like it. There wasn't really anything bad about it. <laughs> The lazy river not working was kind of disappointing. But yeah, you was still good. It, he still enjoyed it, and it was still enjoyable. But when you are expecting a lazy river and you don't get a lazy river, it's just um, a little disappointing. The room was very clean. Um, it was comfortable last night. Did you sleep pretty well? Mm -hmm. You watching bubble guppies? No, I was looking at some fish. <laughs> he said it was one of his favorite rooms as far as you know how it was set up it was nice having a ceiling fan as you can see up above that's not something you normally have in a, in a hotel of any kind um things that we liked we the, the bed was comfortable we slept real well the room temperature stayed really nice it didn't kick on and off and and was super loud it was it was it was good um what else that we we really like we didn't get to judge the breakfast of course because it's during covid and they're not serving breakfast uh, proximity to everything here in Pigeon Forge is very close. We wanted to go to Island. It took us a couple minutes to get the Island. We went for breakfast at Frizzles. It took us a couple minutes to get there. So it's a great location. It's easy to get in and out of, even when it's busy like it is. Um, okay, so overall, great hotel. Would, would I stay here again? Would you stay here again, given the choice? Probably, yeah. I like the water park one, though. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, Probably not one of my favorites, um, but uh, I, I think if you're just looking for a place in Pigeon Forge that's close to everything and is reasonably priced, Clarion Inn is, is, is definitely a, a place you'd want to stay. Will we stay here again? Probably not because we, we're jumping around and there, we have a few places, especially in Gatlinburg, that we absolutely love. But, uh, but it was a good hotel. That will do it for this video from the Great Smoky Mountains. We hope that you have a great day. He needs a nap. No, no.